G'day viewers, Jason, June Love Electrical Services. Uh, real quick video, uh, SIG Energy uh, recall on their 8, 10 and 12 kilowatt single phase inverters is now official. They have been recalled nationally. Um, so there is a recall program in place for them now. Um, if you have an affected unit, um, and you're connected to the int the system is connected to the internet. It would have received a firmware update, which is monitoring um, the AC output of it, and it is de-restricted. If you have one of the affected units and you are off grid or have no Wi-Fi connection to it, then I would advise to monitor it very closely. Um, and if it's installed in an area where, if there were a fire, it could spread to your house or something like that, then it would possibly be wise to shut it down altogether. Um, SIG Energy have record of all of the installed systems, uh, or at least they should do. So you should be contacted by SIG Energy or a service partner to replace your affected unit. Now, if you're waiting for a unit to be installed, um, it's a very tricky situation. Um, obviously, we have the cheaper home batteries subsidy. And that is going to create a problem because as of uh, 1st of January, uh, the rebate drops down. So all those retailers out there that have locked in contracts for these products and haven't installed them yet, they're going to cop a uh, pretty significant loss on the system uh, because they can't be installed at the moment. They have to wait until the new stock, the rectified stock with the modified AC plug comes in and then they can install it. So if you're waiting for an installation of a single phase 8, 10 or 12 kilowatt unit, um, speak to your retailer and try and work that one out. It's a shitty situation. Um, I saw it coming. I saw it. it I knew something was going to happen around their AC plug, I could just tell. Um, they're kind of saying it's installer error. Um, installers are saying it's product error. I still think the issue is somewhere in between the two. The fact is, it's a really fiddly plug to fit off. And if an installer is rushing or doesn't have the proper tools, then it's going to create a um, poor joint on the AC plug. It's going to get hot. It's possibly going to catch fire. Um, so that's the situation. It is a actual recall now, so um, just keep an eye out for correspondence from SIG Energy or your retailer that installed the system, but um, I'm sure they'll deal with it as, as best as they can. Cheers, guys.